welcome to the 5 Minute Fiddle Lesson with Michelle. Today we're going to learn Old Ang Sai in the key of G with double stops. It's a little bit more of an advanced version, but it has a nice full sound and it's very impressive if you're playing with for your friends. Alright, I'm going to play through it once so you can get a feel of what it sounds like. And then we'll um, go back and kind of give you those little tips and tricks to make it sound really good and also talk about your hand frame. Alright, we're just going to go ahead and play through it this time. Here we go. because when you come up here, you're going to have a low two when you play that double stop on the A string, but just before it, you're going to have a high two on the D string. So you have to remember high here, low two here. So you have to do a quick little change there. And then we have normal threes across the board. We are playing with one sharp, which is F sharp, in the key of G. Now, with regarding double stops, the way to make a double stop sound really rich and full, it's all with your bow. So we want to make sure we have good bow holds. I did another video on bow holds, which you can refer back to. But the trick for double stops is to make sure that we have a nice flat bow so we can get both strings. And we also want to make sure we watch our speed, because if we go too slow, it's going to sound crunchy, which we don't want that. But if you go too fast, that's going to sound kind of brisk. So we want just a nice happy medium between a slow bow and a fast bow. So it's more nice and full. So you might want to just practice on open strings first before you add the fingers. But let's go ahead and I'm going to play it a little bit slower so you can see my fingers and my bow technique. And um, hopefully you can play along. Okay, here we go. Ready? And... Michelle Edwards Music, and as always, thank you for watching, and have a great day.